we're going to complete the square and another way to think about that is we're putting this in vertex form we're putting it in a form that's going to help us very easily be able to tell what our vertex is now by the way I can tell what my vertex is very easily by doing negative B that's my B over 2A that's my A which is positive 2 that's my x coordinate of my vertex or h or v sub x sometimes we call it v sub x or h if we say h k that's my h to find my k I could plug that back in and find my k and if I did that let's just do this real quick if I plug that back in I would get negative 8 plus 16 plus 3 because I plugged in 2 everywhere which is 11 so 2 comma 11 is my vertex. Let's just write that up in the corner because I want to, at the end, I want to make sure that I did it right. And again, that's the easiest way to find just your vertex. If they're asking you to just find the vertex, that's the best way to do it, negative b over 2a. But if they're asking you to put it in vertex form, you've got to complete the square. So how do you complete the square? When you've got a coefficient in front of the x squared other than 1, you have to factor that out first. So factoring that out, by the way, don't factor out of that because you're just dealing with these sort of by themselves. Factoring that out of there would give me a negative 4x. Just divide 8 by negative 2, and you get negative 4. Okay? Leave the 3 on the outside. Now the trick is to find out what number I have to put here. And that number is half of that squared. What's half of 4? Negative 2. What's negative 2 squared? Positive 4. If I put that number there, I also have to put that, see how I just unbalanced my equation? I just added something to it. If I'm adding that here, what I'm really adding is negative 8. So if I'm adding negative 8, I also have to subtract a negative 8. Because I added a negative 8 here. Mm -hmm. So I'm subtracting a negative 8, which is the same as adding a positive 8. Okay. All right, so here's my equation. Negative 2, how does this thing factor now? X minus 2 squared, hence complete the square, plus 11. What's my vertex? 2, two neg I'm sorry, positive 2, comma, 11. Which is right there. So it checks out. Okay. That's how I do that problem.